Hey guys, Shadow Cup here, and welcome back to another episode of the sort of PvP mini-series that we're running right now. Um, got a bit of a base established up there. Got a bit of a barn in here. There's absolutely nothing in here right now, and we'll be uh, hopefully taming up some stuff today. And I'll give you a quick tour upstairs here. Takes a minute to climb up, but <laughs> that's okay. <laughs> uh, built this cliff platform. Stuck the base up here just to kind of A, get it out of the way, and B, hopefully keep it a little more camouflaged. Um, a bunch of trees actually respawn directly in the barn there and <laughs> up through the base, so I kind of have to clear those out constantly. But the added benefit is that it kind of keeps it more concealed. So we've got a couple water barrels right here. Uh, this one's closed for now, but uh, it doesn't rain super often. Uh, it seems to sometimes rain twice a day <laughs> sometimes not so uh we've got just basic stuff down here we've got a mortar and pestle table uh cooking pot bed up here i've got some storage not a whole lot <laughs> going on in here some seats a couple of builded things here nothing in there some treasure maps that are probably going to expire before we get to them <laughs> And, um, it's just some materials in here, and a very tiny bit of gold. Let's go in here and grab got some bolas in here. So we'll go ahead and, uh, grab a bunch of these, grab that saddle, and we're gonna go after a bull, because that will be very useful in transporting stuff and building. Oh, that grew. Uh, I've got some plants up here that are growing. Let's see, what do we have? Uh, we've got peppers, chili peppers rather, uh, cactus seed, rice, and what is this? Beans. So yeah, hopefully those will be grown soon. Actually, we should be able to uh, come back and hopefully grab some of those. Maybe uh, get a chicken. I had to do some weird stuff back here because <laughs> there's some clipping issues. <laughs> so I can't actually get a wall back here, um, which is too bad, but that's okay. And couldn't get a wall down here, so I just sort of blocked it in right in there. And then for whatever reason, a triangle seam like, won't fit there. So uh, hopefully I don't fall down there. I might stick a ladder in there just in case. Just because if somebody does come up here and they're looking around or something and they get stuck in there, they don't have to bust through the wall they can just climb out um so we're gonna go ahead and see if we can't find bull to tame up here So, still not a whole lot of people on this island, it seems. Uh, a couple of structures have popped up here and there. There's this little hut right here, don't know... What is it? Oh, it's open. Somebody here? Looks like they're expanding it. So, who is this? Uh, boulders disbanded. Is there anything in here? No, it's been coded. There's no bed or anything, so I don't know. person must be around somewhere. The door was... Well, there was a door, first of all. Unless somebody broke in, which is possible, I guess. Looks like that might have been the case. It's interesting. Very odd. Don't know what happened. Anyways, so that structure has popped up. Uh, we've got some severe overspawning happening down here. So this is what we're going to look for some tames. Started building a pier over here. Uh, I'd like to actually do a public pier kind of of a build, hopefully to sort of keep the coast from getting too littered with ships. So hopefully we'll be building all the way out and be adding slips in and whatnot, more docks. Um, over time, there is a donation box over here. I uh, don't think anybody's donated anything. Literally just started this. There's some fiber in there that I threw in. Um, campfire just in case. For now, 
but ultimately I'd like to put on to like crafting tables and uh, a couple water barrels stuff like that so let's look around there's a couple bulls over here let's check these levels there's quartz on the beach here let's see if we can find one there's a node right there yeah so we've got calcite we've got quartz on the beach here crystal so that's pretty excellent actually <laughs> super super handy all right that one's 17 25 that this guy's a good candidate we'll have to clear out these other bulls level one uh crap loaded elephants crap loaded giraffe some random blue giraffe that's been here for several days now did we already check this guy level five okay Uh, somebody built a shipyard down here pretty recently. Let's go check that out while we're looking for bulls. Level 10. Looks like somebody's been breaking into houses. No strings on me. <laughs> it's a good ship name. Let's go check these guys out real quick. Bulls. There's a bull. Level 18. Okay. So a couple decent levels. Probably go after that level 25 that we saw earlier. Alright, so... We're once this elephant decides to uh, get out of our way, <laughs> we're gonna go after this bull right here. We're kind of gonna see if we can't use the dock as a bit of shelter. Come on, elephant, Ooh, go away! All right. Ah. Oh, we're gonna die now. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna try this again. Why are my uh, glowy things still here? It's weird. <gasps> Crap, we killed it. Did not want to kill it. <laughs> that sucks. Alright. All right, we're gonna have to find another bull somewhere. Um, there was a level 17 one. Where did that guy go? Is that you? All right, we'll try that to, to go after this bull over here. Ah, shit. So, this elephant is really screwing up my team here. It's pretty irritating. Um, there's no way I can get to the bowl. Alright, that elephant is still attacking, so I think the only way to, uh, Do this is gonna be to kill it.
Man, that was annoying. We lost quite a bit of taming progress because of that. That sucks. That's okay though. Um. We also now don't have enough bowlers, so might just give up on this bowl for now. See if we can't find another one. Okay, so we found this other bull. Uh, it's level 16. Not great, but not terrible. Um, we're taming this guy up. We're gonna have to down it one more time. Uh, and I think probably two more feedings. And we'll probably have it. Oh, one more. <laughs> ah, 0.2%. All right, great. So we've got a bull now. Uh, it's got some pretty decent weight. Looks like they may have, they maybe have increased the weight on the bulls. Not really sure. Can't really remember. It's been a while. But this will definitely help us uh, not only get around the island a little bit, uh, but with building. So that would be pretty great. So we're gonna get this guy back to base and probably head out and. Look for... Uh, I might look for... Let's just check these bulls real quick. I might go ahead and look for a cow. Or maybe an ostrich if we have uh, some chilies growing. So we're heading back to the base and uh, actually just found a level 30 female cow. So I'm going to see about uh, grabbing some fronds, which are everywhere. And... Uh, I'll go ahead and team her up. Okay, so we got the cows back home, and it's a bunch of chatter going on in chat right now. Um, looks like our crops are fully grown, which is great. So we can start using those, and made some scissors. So we're going to go ahead and cut and dye our hair here. Got to take off the hat, if I remember correctly. Let's actually, let's see if that, uh, that bug is still doing what it was last season so I'm just curious here yeah you're still getting the, the weird hat head bug thing all right so we're gonna take off that all right cool so uh, we're just gonna chop it all off and color it ooh maybe dreadlocks uh, I think we're just gonna stick with the plain hair for now. All right, cool. So we have a shipyard ready to go in the water, but we're not gonna put it in yet. Uh, instead, what I'm gonna do is uh, gather all the materials for a schooner, and then we'll plop down the shipyard, build the schooner real quick, and go from there. Okay, so we've got the materials for the schooner build, and uh, we've got the shipyard with us right now. We're going to place it down somewhere. Not really sure where yet, but we're going to have a quick swim around. Awesome. Somebody's <laughs> talked at the end of the public pier that I'm in the process of building. <laughs> uh, who are you? <laughs> it's not how you... It's not how, how this works, <laughs> guys. <laughs> Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, anyways, um, I'm not sure if he's doing it to be a dick or just doesn't know how to talk about, <laughs> um, it's okay. <laughs> He'll probably leave eventually. <laughs> uh, let's have a quick look around here. Alright, this area is probably gonna work. Oh man, it looks like somebody's something got sunk here. What's going on here? All right, it's nice and deep here. This is a possibility. I'm gonna whip around the other side of that mountain right there. There's a little alcove over there.
Okay, so we've got uh, the Shipyard in the water, and we've got a couple of decks and all the planks we need to start building the schooner. The rest of the stuff is already crafted for the most part, um, and we're just going to kind of put it together. Alright, so I just closed in the whole deck for right now. I don't know where I want to put the hatch yet. Um, we are probably going to put up the... Let's, uh, let's just figure out what we're going to do here with the walls. Um, hmm. I think we're going to come up one more. Alright, we've got the cabin figured out for the most part here. Uh, might add in a wall, I'm not really sure yet. Yeah, we might section this out. Uh, we do have the sails and the steering wheel. Oh, an old Angus over here, who may or may not be drowning. Maybe we should. All right. <laughs> uh, all right. So basically, going to do similar build to what we've done in the past, but a little bit more modern. Um, typically, the mast on the schooner is actually a little bit further back. Um, usually right about here, but that's blocking the door. Let's see here. Um, we might actually bump that cabin back one. We're going to do this. We're going to bump the cabin back. We're going to rip down that wall and build a, a new walls here. And we're going to put the second mast kind of right in front of this door, right about here. All right, we're going to need to make one more bit note, but that's totally okay. Uh, I'm going to place the steering wheel actually in front of the mast and do this a little bit differently. And also clears out this very front. We might actually uh, go ahead and put the hatch for downstairs either there or maybe off to the side, maybe here, or something like that. Not really sure yet. Uh, we're going to go back to the base, uh, grab a water barrel, some of the other stuff. Uh, so some time has passed and came back over here to see what happened with that ship, and it looks like it was either scuttled or destroyed by somebody. This is rather odd. Or maybe it was anchored in too shallow water? I'm not sure what happened here. I don't have an answer. I'm going to assume it was scuttled. It looks like a um, secret society. Interesting. Yeah, I'm not really sure what's going on, but um, 
Oh, what the heck? It's PvP. Let's demolish this stuff and uh, we'll use the materials for the dock. <laughs> I mean, we're blocking it, right? <laughs> what else? I didn't do it. <laughs> so I have, uh, I have absolutely no idea why this would be sunk. Unless Secret Society has something against these guys or... Secret Society saw my signs and <laughs> decided to sink it. <laughs> that was not my intention, though. <laughs> uh, what was this thing called? Let's find out if um, anybody knows who sank it. AGB. Well, we're gonna see if, uh, if anybody responds here. What's this thing? This wasn't your rapport. Secret Society. Okay. Oh, that's that's fucking hilarious. All right, cool. Um, what we're gonna do, right quick. Let's see here. Um, we don't have any crew, so we have to go ahead and get some crew. And uh, we're definitely gonna need to do some maps. So. What we're gonna do first, real quick, is uh, we'll throw down this here uh, grill and get rid of this. All right, that is going to make a shitload more space. That is much better. Okay, cool. So. Uh, can't really access that window though. I'm just gonna go ahead and close that area. So what we're gonna do, actually right quick, is just run around the island and grab some bottles. Wah. All right, we're gonna go ahead and grab some bottles real quick and see if we can't grab any maps for preferably the other islands. Um, not seeing any bottles though right now. We also have to run over to A10. If we don't see any bottles in a second, I'm probably just gonna give up. All right, I'm not seeing any bottles. Uh, so we're just gonna run right over to A10. We'll grab some bottles uh, over there and some crew. What we'll basically just do is grab some of those crates out of the ocean for a little bit and uh, pay for the crew with that. That'll be fine. Alright, here we go. We're going to go ahead and launch the ship. Uh, we are naming it the Mercantile because it's actually a ship that's uh, in Maine. <laughs> so. It's actually a schooner that's in Maine. <laughs> so I'm totally stealing their name. Don't hate me. And we'll eventually get this guy uh, all painted up and whatnot. Alright, cool. There's a crate right here. So we're going to grab that. Basically just going to grab a couple crates. Um, shouldn't need a ton. Technically we only need 10 gold, but... Um, a couple more would certainly be useful. Alright, cool. We actually got all the, the coins we need. So we're gonna go ahead and turn this guy around. The border's right there. Right there. <laughs> okay, we're in the free port now and got an island straight ahead. We're just gonna stop at that island gonna go ahead and probably run around the island real quick grab any treasure maps we can grab a couple crewmates for the sails here and head back over to B10 and meet up with Alex Crichton there getting some weird weird lag all right <laughs> uh, 
The ping's really high for some reason, I don't know why. Uh, these Freeport Islands are a little bit different than the ones in the northeast. I don't know where the docks are. <laughs> Alright, looks like it might be around on the other side there. So we're gonna head that way. Alright, we're just gonna stop right here. That's fine. I'm gonna run around the island real quick. Um, Alright, so we picked up some crew. We're heading back to B10. We're gonna pick up any crates we see on the way. Hopefully, um, we can locate some honey tonight as well. Alright, made it back to our home island. Uh, just gonna park this bad boy right on our little dock right here. Uh, if it comes out far enough, which I don't know. Uh, we were able to pick up a couple crates on our way, but they were quite shitty. <laughs> so, uh, it's okay, though. We have a couple of treasure maps for Bhutan here. From the Freeport. One of them is on our island, so we're gonna run and do that right quick. We'll grab our bull, see how he fares in combat. So the treasure map that we have for our island uh, is actually, like, right where our raft is. So um, it's actually pretty handy, because what we'll do is we'll scuttle the raft, because we haven't gotten uh, back over there yet. So we'll scuttle the raft, we'll do the treasure map, which is, like, right here. Um, Grab that gold, drop that back off at the boat for the crew. I love people like this, it's so funny. He actually thinks that he's pissing me off, but... <laughs> but that's cool. So it's interesting, I mean, uh, we've been playing PvP now for... When did Mega Uptake go? Um, Friday? Thursday? It's the only complete asshole that we've met. Um, everybody else has been pretty awesome. So, that's fine. What we'll end up doing probably is, uh... We got that sloop going. Might just build that. And then, um, go ahead and... Um, I'm not sure what else. Um, so our crew is actually fine. So we're gonna... Bring these guys back base, I think, briefly, and um, go ahead and finish up that screener build. He didn't even, like, salvage half this, so that's pretty cool. What we're going to do is um, probably throw a container or something onto the dock right here. We're going to salvage that up, and uh, what we'll probably end up doing is using the supplies... Um, might actually use them over here. Actually, just built a storage box real quick. And uh, what we'll do is we'll probably just stick it right under the dock there. I'll go ahead and salvage the rest of the the ship and uh, finish building up that sloop. Uh, so we built a sloop real quick, um, but I have a feeling Alex logged off, or left. It's not responding, so um, we'll try a couple more times. I'm gonna grab some of these um, cargo crates. Picked up um, a little gold from that treasure map, but that's back at the base. Oh my god, why lag? Why? Alright. <laughs> uh. Kind of feels good to be back on a sloop, to be honest. But we're going to... Oh. That's very handy. Cool. So we're just going to cruise around a little bit and uh, pick up some cargo crates. And we're going to head over... How much do I have in here? 14. Um, I think what we're going to do is just head over to A10. We're going to pick up some new crew. Um, the dude didn't kill our crew, but... A tiger did. <laughs> uh, it like spawned right next to my dog. It was epic. Anyways, so we're gonna go pick up a couple more crewmates here and uh, sail around a little bit, see if we can't find some honey, pick up a few more crates, and whatnot. 
So we just pulled into the northmost island in the area, and uh, this is freaking gorgeous. And there doesn't really seem to be many people here. Um, I'm actually kind of tempted to move here. <laughs> uh, I mean, look at this. This is cool. There's a house up there. Of some kind. Just a little shack, looks like. Oh, that's all in Navy. Ran into those guys earlier. Um, they shot at me. <laughs> but it was totally by accident. Uh, they had their cannons on auto fire. Um, I'd given them a pretty wide girth, but I think it's not wide enough. Alright, so we finally found some, uh, some sweets here. Found my damn shovel. Alright. So we're gonna roam around a little bit more. See what else we can find on this island. Hopefully we can find some more honey. Or some other types of sugar. Really anything. <laughs> we really need it. <laughs> No shack here. It says 404. Somebody who's gone. All right, here's another honey. Thingamajig. Okay, so yeah, I'm actually uh, pretty tempted to move up here. It's a very lovely location. And it's kind of difficult to get up here and whatnot, so that's not a bad thing. Um, let's uh, let's get up to the peak right there real quick. But now that we've found some honey, that's great. Really, uh, we won't have to go too too far for that. Ah, here's a couple more, too. Oh, another little pond lake thing. Oh, neat. Yeah, I don't know, man. I'm, I'm really tempted to just move here. Well, we made it back to the base safe and sound, and we've got plenty of honey to last us quite a bit of time. So that's great. We're going to make some fridge bags. <laughs> And, uh, I don't know, I'm sure there's other stuff that we need it for. Uh, we have quite a bit of organic paste already, just because of uh, ants and scorpions around here. So that's not a huge concern. We're going to go ahead and chuck our honey in here. We picked up some halfway decent engrams and, uh, or blueprints rather. And we picked up some halfway decent blueprints as well, so we're going to definitely make some of this. Um, got an upgrade to the bow. It's not a huge upgrade, but it's better than nothing. <laughs> We've got a pick somewhere. Where's the pick? I can't remember where I put the pick. But there was a pick somewhere. <laughs> and... Uh, it's more of this sort of random stuff here. Um, we've got a couple maps to do in this region, so we'll probably do that next time. And and yeah, we're probably just going to end the episode right there. If you guys enjoyed it, hit that like button. If you want to see more, hit subscribe. Uh, we'll be back with more of this sort of PvP series uh, right up until, at the very least, uh, the PvE server comes out. And then we might switch over, we might stay, just don't know yet. <laughs>